could be would he have any problems? Did uh, Foxy ever appear in the hallway? Probably not. I was just curious. Like I said, he was always my favorite. They tried to remake Foxy, you know? Uh, they thought the first one was too scary, so they redesigned him to be more kid-friendly and put him in Kid's Cove uh, to keep the toddlers entertained, you know. But kids these days just can't keep their hands to themselves. The staff literally had to put Foxy back together at the end of every ship. So eventually they just stopped trying and left him in some kind of take-apart, put-back-together attraction. Now he's just a mess of parts. I think the employees refer to him as just the mangle. Uh, oh, hey, before I go, uh, I wanted to ease your mind about any rumors you might have heard lately. Uh, you know how these local stories come and go and seldom mean anything. I can personally assure you that whatever is going on out there, however tragic it may be, has nothing to do with our establishment. It's just all rumor and speculation, people trying to make a buck, you know. Uh, our guard during the day has reported nothing unusual, and he's on watch from opening till close. Okay, well anyway, hang in there and I'll talk with you tomorrow. What is that? Is that the bunny? Yeah. Jeez, oh, and now the music box is going down. I'm gonna get killed. Yep. Oh, hey, they're gone. This is. I'm already like stressed the out. The most frustrating game I've ever played. Oh, the balloon guy's gone. Balloon boy, please. Sorry. Did you misgender balloon? Uh, no, I did not. It, Actually, they're technically both the same didn't. gender because they're balloon guy and balloon boy. I hate this foxy. Well, what is that? That's fox. What the heck is that? Is that, that is the chica. Is it the old Chica? I think that's uh, Thirst Trap or whatever it is. Thirst <laughs> Trap? It's like Spring Trap. It's spring Trap, yeah, that's what it was. Oh, it's Thirst Trap. <laughs> oh no, the balloon guy is moving. I bet the balloon guy's in the, the cage. Or the vent. In what the am I cage? saying? What, what am I saying? saying? The Border Patrol? <laughs> <laughs> we have to put that little kid in a cage. Yeah, I think, I think we need to get ICE on Balloon Boy here. <laughs> like, get him out of this game. <laughs> We need to deport him back to hell Balloon where he Boy came says from. hello, but he happened... When Balloon Boy says hello, I see he's like, eh. When Balloon Boy says hello in Spanish... <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get rid of this guy! <laughs> okay, come on, it's Fox get again. out of here, man! This Fox appears like five times every hour. Like, he is the most obnoxious thing in the world. Well, I feel like this Fox, it's a test for... What? I was gonna say epilep... Oh! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That scared the crap out of me. It's a test for what? Epilepsy. Epilepsy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Check the... Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, there's the Bonnie in the left. And that dumb fox again. <laughs> what is this? What is happening? Okay, you have to go do the... Oh, jeez. <laughs> It's like happening. <laughs> I feel like this game was Scott being like, oh really? You like FNAF? Well here you go. <laughs> He's like angry that his other games didn't do well before this. <laughs> he like purposely is making you hate the game. <sighs> I feel like me with Batman Arkham, I just put like subliminal messages in it like, hate yourself. <laughs> I want you to die. <laughs> All this awful stuff. Okay, <laughs> hey, how do you pull up the map? Oh, okay, there we go. That's Dora. <laughs> Be like on The Simpsons when they had subliminal messaging to have people join the Navy. Wait, was that real? Yeah, they, it was. There was an episode where they had Bart. Uh, the Navy recruited Bart and uh, Nelson and Milhouse and. Oh, who's the other one? Oh, Ralph. And they had them join like a boy band. And they like auto-tuned the heck out of them. And like their song was like, their song was join the Navy, but backwards. <laughs> <laughs> and like in the episode, everyone's like, huh, I kind of feel like joining the Navy. <laughs> <laughs> And they had like these ladies like going on like Ida Net Niage. 
I have to blow my nose. So sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh man, I think I think I heard some breathing. It was probably me with my freaking allergies, man. Our allergies or something else? Allergies. Okay. Just making sure. Oh jeez. What? 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 Oh no! How you do I put get the rid mask of on? Hold our. Oh, 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 these people are gonna care yeah, who gonna I am. In, he's gonna be like, I'm T-posing. These people are gonna care who I am. Did he back up? I don't know. How do you get but rid you of this guy? You don't flash him. You just have to put the mask on. Well, I did that before and it didn't work. I understand, but it usually takes five or six seconds. Oh, look, the music box is running out. <sighs> this dumb music box is really grinding my gears. I know, right? It's really yanking my chain. Oh, it's not the only thing oh, on you that'll be getting yanked. <sighs> Why do they send out this dumb bunny and then also Foxy at the same time? Hey man, I don't know. I have no idea. I was trying to look for something that, uh... Yeah, okay, so this is gonna be pretty old, but it's really sad. Um, so I don't know how to say her name, so apologies. But did you see that the Resident Evil voice actress passed away? I did see that. I saw that a little bit ago. Uh, I think it's uh, Jeanette Mao. Yeah, is that that's for the games, right? Or the movie? I, I didn't. I didn't see. Um, it's for the games. Oh, okay. She did a lot in Resident Evil Eight, especially with some of the primary antagonists of the series, oh. or of that entry. Okay. So it's a shame the game's not even out yet, and she won't even get. You know, praise for her job. It seemed like she did a really good job. I only saw, you know, a tiny bit in the new trailer. Right. Or, I'm sorry, the playable teaser, whatever. Right. But obviously, there's more important things than just her not getting credit for her work. I mean, That's as a person, the only thing that matters. But it is kind of sad, you know. Right. Talented. Yeah, wasn't she only 39? I believe so. Yeah. Do you know what she died of? Was it? I thought it was cancer. Oh. But okay. um. I don't actually, I don't actually know because there was conflicting information on it. Oh, uh, colon cancer. Oh, okay. By the way, I don't know if this is why this is, but a lot of people who suffer from cancer have really gotten the short end of the stick since this virus came. Right. Because their treatments have been moved or pushed back or whatever. Um, my stupid phone keeps like buzzing. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it's uh, it's sad. That's the same thing my dad passed away from. Colon cancer. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Put on the mask and hold it on. Yeah, it's uh, about two years ago, but um, or a little less than two years ago. But it's one of those things where it just ravages your your immune system when you, especially when you treat it. Right. How come these guys are still there? Uh, I don't know. Maybe they like will pop into the room. As I soon as they pop in the room, you have to hold RB, like, immediately. Yep. Oh, man, that was a close call there. Yep, and you have to just keep it on until till the whole thing comes back. Yep. Now it should be gone. And that thing's gone. Oh, but, oh man, the sex cheek is there. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, you might want to the music box. Oh, and this the balloon boy. I was gonna call him something else. What are we gonna call him? Something pretty inappropriate. Something. I'm just not gonna go there. Uh, These guys are so obnoxious. So wind the box now. Okay. Come down, mask probably. Yep. Oh man. <laughs> yep. That freaked me out a little bit. So I was reading that you want to mask every single time you drop the thing. Oh. On later nights. So I don't know. We're at 4 a.m., dude. But yeah, uh, it, it's sad, you know, and I mean, it's one of those things, too, which... Oh, uh, Balloon Boy. Like, not to be morbid, but I feel like if my dad was still around, he probably... Like, if he had lived this long with his colon cancer, the movement of treatments probably would have been bad, too. You know what I mean? Right. I don't know if that happened to this young woman, so I'm not saying that, but I'm just saying it's happened to a lot of people. And the hospitals have limited capacity... Right. Whole thing's a mess. What? Jeez. Oh, There's dumb... Balloon Boy, dude. Yep. How do you get rid of him again? You have to do this thing. You have to put the mask on? Uh, yeah, you have to put the mask on, because then Balloon Boy cares who you are and goes away. Oh, okay. But I'm worried about this dumb fox. He's gone. Check on Balloon. 
I don't think he moved. Oh, jeez! Hold it on. Yep. Keep pulling that. And I have to pull it through the stupid music box. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I had it! Maybe you did it a little too late. I don't know. I had it on. I I know. And it was like five. I know. <laughs> I know. I hate this game. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, this game sucks. Like, I'm just gonna say it. I am just gonna say it. So you this actively dislike it. I actively dislike this game. I'm getting there. The first game was really fun. Yes, what happened? Oh, I'll tell you what happened. This stupid music box happened. I have to keep checking this every 15 seconds. I know. And then they added in that dumb balloon boy. And then they add like 12 versions of the regular people. And then this fox has to show up like every four seconds. And each person has like a different way to kill them. So it's just like, how are you supposed to beat this? Parent reviews for Five Nights at Freddy's 2 from Common Sense Media. I don't know if I need to do parent review. <laughs> They're like, hey, this uh, game is full of satanic things. <laughs> oh, well, uh, here's the thing. This is from Sophia. Oh, I'm uh -oh. not gonna release any more names. Sophia from the channel? No, not that one. Oh, okay. Which Sophia is that? The Sophia. Uh, oh, on our live streams. Yeah, on our live streams. No, I don't not remember. that one. Okay. I don't think she's a parent. Oh, that was Sophia Ali. Is what it was. That's Sophia. Okay. Sorry. Anyways, continue. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Misgender his name. Face Sorry. the wrath. Um. So you're gonna have to do that. Glad people can. Oh no, not Balloon Boy! If Balloon Boy's not careful, I'm gonna make him my balloon toy. Nice. <laughs> Anyways, I think Five Nights at Freddy's 2 is much better than the first game. There is a little more violence in this one. Well, when I say that, I mean more animatronics, but also a bit more protection. Phone Guy says that the company gave you a Freddy head to defend yourself. If they come near you, put on the head. Eventually, whatever wandered in will wander right back out. And e and one of the animatronics is easily tamed by winding up a music box. It's easy! Oh yeah, that's easy. Are these parents like 80? Oh. Dude, someone's in the vent. Check who it is. Oh jeez. Withered Bonnie? Yeah, yeah, it's Withered Bonnie. What do I do? You have to put on the mask when he pops in the room. Oh jeez. How do so, I know when he's gonna pop in the room? Well, it just happens. So. It'll be like when you put down your mask once. I think it's random. Oh, jeez! Now you hold it on. Um, eventually, whatever wandered in will wander back out. Can be tamed by... The Balloon Boy takes the batteries from your flashlight, which allows you to see, unlike the first game, so there's, there's no way to prevent Foxy from killing you. I thought it said from milking you. Can't you just, like... So, anyways, as I said Balloon before, out. not really a lure-to-sleep kind of game. Do not play in the dark or before bed to prevent bad thoughts and nightmares from occurring. <laughs> okay, here's the thing I'll say about this parent. I actually like... Look, I don't like Karens, but, right? But I've I, there's some dumb stuff on this site. I actively like how parents help other parents. Like, hey, listen, this is in this game, so you might want to know about that before your kid plays it, right? Because you know, like, here's an example. Like, I want to know what game my kid can pick up and destroy prostitutes in. Put on the mask. Put on the mask. Like, GTA 5. Like, I want to know, I want common sense reviews. Like, hello, this is, uh, who's the guy from The Simpsons? A poo? Yeah. Actually, poo. I probably shouldn't do that. I probably should not do that one since people got mad at that. <laughs> <laughs> I was starting to, and I was like, uh, put on the mask. Yep. He's going to come in. I know, I know, I know. I have to wind this music box. Okay, don't yell at me. What in the name of Mike is this? Mike? What do you mean, Mike? <laughs> You want me to try? Yes. <laughs> okay, give me a break. This game is so dumb. But yes, I, I agree with that. I, I like parents telling me so that I can so that I can have my kids bang as many prostitutes as he wants. Yeah. I mean, I want to know where to send him to get as much women as possible. What is that? Is that old Freddy? That is actually one of the victims. So wh what I don't understand is that these animatronics are not the ones from FNAF 1. So... These animatronics are the ones from the very first Freddy Fazbear's location, right? 
Freddy Fazbear's Diner? Uh, yes. Like, not those, not the toy ones. Right, not the sexual ones. Right. Okay, but that chica is pretty odd. Yeah, she's dummy thick. <laughs> Do you think, dude, you know what would be sick? What if she, you know, when you put on the mask, she thought you were... Dancing bear? Yeah. Dancing bear? You yeah. Freddy? <laughs> yeah. Like, what if she thought you were Freddy? Oh, I thought you meant, like, dancing bear, like the... There's, like, a adult... <laughs> Yeah, I know. That's what I was referencing. <laughs> How did you know what that was? Oh, oh I, I, I got to run to work. I got to stop this right now. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I knew what you were saying, but in my head, I was like, there is no way Nate knows what that is. Like, there's no well, way he knows uh, what that is. So. Uh, not that I've uh, involved in that community at all. Um, uh, community. What, uh, what were you saying about Chica? Is there a subreddit? That? Uh, not not that I'm the leader of this subreddit or anything like that. Uh, what were you saying about Chica? At least you're in a position of power. <laughs> I was <laughs> very fitting Some for some. Consider me a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you did it wrong. No, some consider me a teacher. But you consider yourself I consider a myself terrorist. a terrorist. <laughs> Lesson number one. <laughs> I'm terrorizing uh, people's minds. As long as there's a woman in the room, the video can't possibly be you know what <laughs> Nate checking to see if he has his socks on before turning uh, on the okay I do <laughs> thank goodness <laughs> if that dummy thick chica ever came at you would you allow her I wouldn't stop her <laughs> You wouldn't stop her. You'd be like, yeah, you can uh, BDSM me all you want. So my flashlight batteries are at half. Well, you're already at 2 a.m. Well, that's what happens to the batteries when you're like the epileptic king. <laughs> like, it's pretty ridiculous. The epileptic <laughs> king. <laughs> yeah, you're like pro at this. Like, <laughs> Oh, no, I thought the kid like was here. Um, Who's in the hallway? No one yet. I think someone will be in the hallway when you get off this. Someone's in the vent. I think I think the balloon boy's in the vent. Yeah, balloon boy's in the vent. But you also have to make sure the fox is not in the dumb hallway. <sighs> Three, four, five, six. And now, see, it's spring trap. Now you're gonna have to go. It's not spring trap. Whatever. It's, it's withered Bonnie. The withered Bonnie. I'm getting the names mixed up, but everyone. No. no put on the mask. Put on the mask quick. Balloon Boy might be in the vent, but I think the fox probably would be in the hallway. Yep, the fox is in the hallway. And Balloon Boy is now in the vent again. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, jeez. See, why does that work? Ah, now Chica's in there. Three... Four, five, six. That should work. Balloon Boy just moved. Oh, someone's gone from the hallway. But we're check the vents. Okay, Chica's still in there. Put on the mask. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's dummy thick Hell chica. Yeah, that's my favorite. Now we're talking. <laughs> you like you hear the you hear the dude unzip. Oh, no. <laughs> Unzips and he puts his mask down there. Oh. <laughs> well, you have to protect yourself from Chica, who is not getting out of the vent there. I think Chica's just stuck. That's why he's not leaving the vent. Two, three, four, five, six. The Chica's flashlight's still... almost out, so. Yep. Check the vent. And now uh, do the music box and then put on the mask. Try putting the mask on, but facing towards the vent. I don't know if this does anything, but maybe Pretty it sure will. Pretty sure it does not. Okay. Uh, Balloon Boy's in the vent. Oh, jeez! Three, four, five, six. Now Balloon Boy's gonna be in the vent, and the fox is probably down the hallway. 
Yep. And Bloom Boy, I think, is in the vent. Yep. Oh, Fox, I think, is gone. Three, four, five, six. You had the music box. <sighs> You're at 5 a.m. Put on the mask right there. when you put down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Check the. Oh, wait. Who is. Put your thing on! I was trying. I think I might have been too late. Come on! Oh, jeez, you were at like 5 a.m. Mangle, check your vents and the hallway. If she is in the hallway, treat her like Foxy and keep flashing your light at her. If she is in the vents, put your mask on and wait for the thumping noise to cue when she has left your vents. If she is on your ceiling in your office, you will need luck on your side because she can attack any time after you put up and then lower your monitor. In the earlier nights, Mangle will take a few ups and downs of the monitor to jump scare, but in the later nights, it will most likely happen after once. Yeah, that's that's kind of the ridiculous thing about Mangle is you could get lucky with it. You could get totally lucky and just not have it trigger. Or you could have her attack you instantly. Trigger? Yeah, you could you can actually trigger her. You can call her slurs oh, and geez. also give your opinion. <laughs> that one's too far. <laughs> Come on, let me shine in there. Check the hallway. Okay, there he goes. You are at half flashlight. And someone's in the vent. Yep. He literally Put just the moved. Mask. He just moved to the vent, is all. Four, five, six. Check the hallway. Yep, I knew it. I knew he was going to put a sly one, one on me. <laughs> oh, jeez. Mask. I don't know if that I was think, too late I or not. Too I don't late. know if that was too late or not. I think it was. So if he jumps us, yeah. You have to do it immediately. Well, I don't, have the, I don't have that kind of reflexes. I know. Like, they expect you to be like... <laughs> what do they expect you to be like? They're like... <laughs> okay. It's like, jeez. This guy's going to put me in a coffin. What? <laughs> Scott Coffin's gonna put me His in the His name is Coffin. I know, I keep calling him Coffin. <laughs> so you don't even have a battery for like your screen? It's just your flashlight. Yeah. Yeah, I think you could just have the screen up the entire time. But the fox will jump you. <laughs> <laughs> 